Lesson Learn is the title of Tyler Perry's Rupless Season 3, Episode number 16. An injured Brian and Andrew are at odds while tied up, but realize they may need each other in the end if they have any chance of survival. So this show synopsis tells us right here that Andrew is indeed getting caught and is going to end up in the punishment trailer, well, the torture trailer with Brian. Tied up, it says. Lord have mercy. Listen, I really don't think that I'm going to be able to get through this episode. Why is Andrew still in the compound? Why? And he's going to end up getting caught. And it's probably because of Happy Harold. Happy Harold. <laughs> Gonna get him caught up by telling Manny that the only place that he hasn't checked is that tower, which is where they just may find Andrew in the bottom part of the tower on his belly. And his theory, it does make a lot of sense, right? I mean, he knows exactly where and how soldiers will hide out in battle. So he's giving Andrew up without it being confirmed that if Andrew is even in there, right? But however he gets found out, he's getting caught. Why isn't Andrew already gone? His heart has led him to look out for other people, right? To check on his brothers in kind to make sure they're going to be okay and if they wanted to go with him. But maybe this wasn't the best move because the cat is out of that FBI bag with you running around the compound telling everyone who you are. Not the best move, Andrew. And here it also lets us know that he and Brian are going to be at odds with each other. For what? Y'all <laughs> Y'all both caught up, tied up on the compound. And I'll bet everything that Daikon's going to have an absolute ball with Andrew being tied up, right? He's been yapping for two whole seasons that Andrew was an agent. Do y'all think that Mac is really in with the highest and Daikon? Did he really let them know that Andrew was coming to the compound on assignment? And this is why Daikon was so adamant about Andrew admitting it. I don't know. I still don't believe that Mac is in on it. Otherwise, why is the highest so tight every time somebody mentions the government, if you're on their payroll? If Mac is in with them and the sheriff has already got his hands on the cartel's money, then who's left to save the agents, the women, and the children? Who? There's nobody left. The only people who may have an ounce of a chance is Paula, Sam, Nancy, and Richard. That's it. And we all know Sam is shot up, laid up in St. Rhodes. <laughs> so it's only so much that he can do. Y'all, we gotta have some good guys left, right? He's already taken Oliver out. Rivers, <laughs> if we can get him to stop crying and try to stop stealing, then maybe he could focus and try to wrap his brain cells around an escape plan. Then maybe, just maybe he'll be useful. And all the other men on the compound, they're just totally brainwashed. Andrew should have been rounding up soldiers. He should have been had an escape plan and he should have let Oliver go, right? And now he's ending up in the exact same predicament as Oliver in that punishment trailer or the torture trailer. Either one is bad news. But in the end, they both realize that if they want to survive, they're going to have to lean on each other. And now will be the perfect time for them to put those FBI techniques to use, right? And study firsthand how everybody is moving on that compound. But Brian and Andrew seem to have a slightly higher intelligence level <laughs> than everybody else, right? It really appears that way, like their IQ scores is higher than most of them there. So I really hope that they can use these expertise and find a way to escape. Let me know your thoughts by dropping your comments below. What do you think about Andrew getting caught and ending up having to try to escape? Skate with Brian. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. I'd really appreciate it. And if you're a Ruthless fan, go ahead and sub to the channel because I do videos like this all the time. Thank you so much for joining me on today's episode of Ruthless TV, you guys, and I'll see you on the next one.